Guys, let's see a simple function to calculate average in Python. Okay, let's see, we have num1 and it's 10. Num2 is 20. Now we want to have average of this and we want to write a function for this one. Uh, so let's write a function. Def define a function, this is a keyword. And let's say we call it avg, which is average, and then parenthesis, colon. Here, in this uh, method definition here, we will get these num1 and num2. So let's get them right away. Num1 and num2, right? So once you're here, hit enter. We want to have average, and we want this method to return us the average. So let's call uh, return uh, call. Then we can have num1 plus num2, and then divide by two. That's it. So we have this method. We will add the, those two numbers, and then divide by two, return those. And then once we return, we will get that. Let's call them avgval, like average value. And here we need to call this method because if I don't call this method, if I save and run, you will see nothing, okay? A method is there, but we have not invoked it, called it. So we need to call this function avgval and function name avg we need to pass these two values num1 and num2 i can simply copy these two okay put it there because these two are going here we're passing them they go here 10 and 20 10 plus 20 30 divided by 2 15 and it will return as 15 we will get that 15 here now once we get it let's print that AVG val. All right. Okay. And if we want to get it from the user, uh, yes, we can do like we did before. We use input method to get value from the user. We can have a message and the first value. Okay. And then here, input. Your second value. But see, whenever you write like this, it will get as a string, not a number. So we will get errors. So let's see, enter first value, which is 10, and second number 20, and then we get this error, okay? Because when we try to perform this the addition operation, so it will say string and string, a string and integer. So this is a problem, okay? Because inside is string and outside is integer so this is getting problem so what we need to do we need to get these num1 num2 because we are reading as a string we need to convert them into integer and that is very simple here you will put int parenthesis and close that there here so basically it's like this int in parenthesis so we'll put that one here inside so int int so whatever value now we'll get 10 20 30 50 that will not be dealt as string it will be dealt as uh, integer so let's see now 10 20 now is good okay uh, any other value whatever you like 20 50 okay this is the value okay that's all thank you very much